Hey guys, it's me, Scratch Out Two, and today we will be making a health bar, but only using pet. As you can see here, this is it. It doesn't really work because there's no code except for this. So yeah, this is what it will look like. So yeah, let's so let's start with the basics. When green flag clicked, we will need two variables, health and max health, and this will be a backpackable sprite also. You don't need these X and Y things, but I'm I'm just going to use them for my movement. So, set max health to whatever max health you want. And then we set health to max health. So, yeah, that basically sets to 100. Also, double click the health two times to change it to a slider. Now, forever. Watch me Okay, now it's time to make our health bar. Health bar. Wait, no. Create health bar. At X and Y. Max health. Wait, no. We'll just put. Here then health input and then health slash and then max health. Oh, got screen refresh. Okay. Pretty long block, right? So yeah, I'm gonna replace these change X and change Y bias with X and Y. So when you're doing this, you might want to use the thing of thing block and like put this as the player and then the health inputs. So yeah, I'm gonna put this to X and Y, health inputs, health and max. Health. Here we go. So create health bar app. So as you can see, I'm starting with one blink costume because we're making this completely with pen. But before anything, add the pen uh, extension. I already have it because scratch add-ons automatically adds it there, including text description. So before we start anything, erase all. Next, go to X and Y. So we go to the Y and then go to X, the X here from the input, minus max health divided by 2. Yeah. So this will basically move us the half of the other way we need to go to. So our health bar will be about 100 pixels because the max health is 100 pixels. So it's just going to be the max, uh, the amount of max health pixels. If you can get that. Next. Set pen size to uh, 25. Right now, we're going to be making the black part of our pen. So we set pen color, or actually not the number one, but the the one where you can set the color. And then you set brightness just completely to zero. There we go. So now pen down. Next, move health. Wait, no, not health, max health steps. And then pen up. Let's see how that looks. As you can see, we have our black outline now. So now, if health is greater than zero, then we're going to draw our health block. So first, we set the pen size to 20 which is smaller than the black one and then so that it can like be on top of it and you can actually see the black part too next we set the pen color to red this is very important because when i was making this before i forgot to add this and it didn't really look good so you set pen color to red then we change pen color by 110 plus 0.25 times health. This will allow us to change the color of our health bar. 
Well, yeah, we'll have to change the color of our health bar. Pen down. And then we move health steps, not max health. Because we're going to be showing our health and then pen up. And boom, let's try that out. And oh my god. Oops, I forgot. And this, we, before the if, we set x to the x minus max health divided by 2. Okay. Now, as you can see, our health bar with pen is looking pretty neat. I mean, once it reaches like 0, it does that. And when it's 1, it's here. But I mean, it's better than nothing, right? So yeah, as you can see, it's fully functional. And you, and you can move it around, you know. Like, let me just create a player to show you why. Okay, so I have the cat sprite, which can move. So now, uh, I don't need these X and Y variables. So you could just put, use the thing of thing block, like I said before, and then like the Y position of cat and the X position of cat. And you can add to the Y position of cat just so that there's a, so that's not like directly on the, on it. And boom, as you can see. We have the rookie health bar. It's really, really smooth because, you know, pen. And yeah. See, the, the pen spar allows us to create, like, drawings, you know? Like, you don't have to. So, to make a drawing game, you don't need to, like, use clones. You can just use the pen. The pen extension unit, you, you know? So yeah, there we have it. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and share as it helps the channel. We are so, so close to 100 subs. So subscribe and hit that notifications bell and have a wonderful day. Yeah, I just love this health bar. I'm going to backpack it right now. Okay. So there we go.